October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and we're joined by Ambassador Nancy Brinker, who is the founder of the Komen Foundation. You can't go anywhere without seeing <laughs> pink. It's been very successful so far this year. It has, it has, and we at Susan G. Komen are very uh, happy on many fronts um, that our research is, is moving along, uh, community health programs are good, and the global health programs are exciting. But of course, there are challenges uh, that we're, we're concerned about. For example, in the U.S., uh, we found and determined that over 50% of women who have health care coverage, Nora, are not having mammograms. So that makes it very difficult to keep the great survival rates that we've been able to drive with, with others over the years at a high level. Uh, you know, screening's not perfect, it's not cure, it's not treatment, but it is the only tool we have now, and it does work 80 to 85 percent of the time. And that's why awareness is so important. The, yeah. the White House was yeah. lit up pink the other night. You saw NFL players right. wearing uh, pink. Why, why did you use the NFL in that way, and why did you ask them to also show their support? Now, we also, we, in the NFL is a great example, but it is quite amazing when people go and they see, you know, a, a men's sport, I mean, men playing the game, uh, very involved and concerned about their mothers, their sisters, uh, all the women in their lives, and men, too, who develop breast cancer. And, you know, this is a, a family disease. It is the, one of the leading killers of women around the world and I think it is very appropriate for the NFL to show their support as well as other sports, Major League Baseball, um, some of the basketball teams. We've had a great deal. LPGA is a great supporter of ours. So uh, this is a very important for a, and venue for us to be able to uh, talk about this, this disease which was only whispered about not too long ago. Mm -hmm. What's your goal? this year. You've been around for a while. You've yeah. been extraordinarily successful. What's your goal for well, this year? Well, our goal now for the next 10 years will be to drive um, to, to drive survival rates up, up to 2% 2 a year. In other words, th that many fewer deaths every year. And, and to begin to see people live a lot longer who have advanced stages of this disease. Uh, and then at the end of that time, we're hoping in not too long we'll have a blood marker to determine uh, if you're developing the disease at, for, at, the, at a biologic level. And then, of course, our ultimate goal is to learn how to prevent breast cancer. All right, Ambassador Nancy Brinker. Thank you. Thank you, Nora. Thank, Thank you. Thanks a lot.